You could spend the evening with family and friends by kicking off your Independence Day plans with this evening's United Way Fireworks and Freedom Fest at the Vero Center south of Kearney. Kearney United Way Executive Director Savannah Lyon joins us now for more on all of the fun that is planned. Savannah, this evening's Fireworks and Freedom Fest, a fundraiser for the Kearney United Way. Talk about how this evening is such a win-win for both the fun evening and helping the efforts of the Kearney United Way. Paul, one of the things I think is the most important things that we can do as people is to come together as a community. If we do not come together to celebrate good things and have fun, I think that we're going to struggle to come together when there is a crisis or a need. People are really disconnected from one another right now. They don't know their neighbors, and they don't have a lot of close friends. So I think that this is a perfect way to build community connections and relationships while also supporting the work that we do for people who are in need. Savannah, when can we start showing up for this evening's United Way Fireworks and Freedom Fest at the Vero Center? And what can we enjoy for some good food at the time that a lot of us like to eat supper? Yeah, so the gates are going to open at 6 p.m. People are welcome to bring food and grills, beverages, whatever they want to tailgate. But we'll also have food trucks there with a variety of items like pizza, macaroni and cheese, barbecue, snacks, ice cream, lemonade. Some new trucks will be out there. They'll be debuting for the first time, and so they're really excited, and we're excited to have them. Okay, it's a good comfort food, it sounds like. Savannah, before the fireworks, what activities does the Freedom Fest offer for both the young and old? Yeah, this event is for all ages. We will have bingo, a cornhole tournament, yard pong, caricature drawings, a cash cube, a slip and slide, dunk tank, a DJ will be out there, and bounce houses. So the cornhole tournament is $10 per team to enter, and we will have two rounds with fun prizes for the top two teams at each tournament. The dunk tank is $5 for six balls, and we'll have bingo for $0.25 cents per game as well. So we have really fun prizes for the cornhole tournament and the cash cube, and people are also welcome to set up their own yard games at their tailgating spot. The event is festive, but also relaxed. It's really what you want to make it. Savannah Lyon, Executive Director of the Carney United Way, is talking with us right now about their fireworks and Freedom Fest at the Bureau Center at South of Carney this evening. Savannah, the fireworks and Freedom Fest caps off the evening with those amazing fireworks. When do the fireworks start? How long of a show can we expect? And what will we see that make us say ooh and ah? The fireworks start about 10 p.m. when it gets dark. We do expect to have a longer show than last year, likely between 15 and 20 minutes. But I'm honestly going to be as surprised as everyone else. We contract the Axel Fire Department to handle the fireworks for us. So I don't know what they're planning, but I am very excited to see it. The evening's fireworks and Freedom Fest at the Vera Center helps out the work of the Carney United Way. Samantha, how much does it cost to enjoy that fun, and when does that get us? Also, how can we get tickets beforehand or at the gate? Tickets are $35 per car when you purchase them in advance on our website at uwka.org. They're $45 at the gate. If you purchase online in advance, it's a very smooth process. You show your QR code, get scanned in, and then you are on your way. Every car can have a tailgating spot if they wish, which includes a spot to park and a spot to hang out. We will have a general parking area for people who don't want to tailgate and plan to just enjoy the activities that we've provided. Once inside, everyone has access to the bounce houses, free character drawings, yard pong game, and other activities. Additionally, they get a front row seat to the fireworks. More importantly, though, you know that your purchase is going to help United Way and our great partner agencies as we advocate for and meet the needs of children and people in our communities. Savannah, anything else that you would like to add about this evening's Freedom Fest and Fireworks Show at the Bureau Center with the United Way? I just want to encourage people to come out and enjoy themselves. It's a safe environment for all ages to enjoy the event. You don't want to miss it. It's a great opportunity to meet new people and have fun. Well, thank you for joining us, Savannah, and have yourself a happy Independence Day. You too. Thank you, Paul. That's the Executive Director of the Carney United Way, Savannah Lyon, talking to us about the Fireworks and Freedom Fest at the Vero Center south of Carney. All of that fun begins as early as this evening at 6 o'clock. For more, you can check out the Facebook page for the 2024 United Way Fireworks and Freedom Fest. Again, that's the Facebook page for the 2024 United Way Fireworks and Freedom Fest. You can purchase those tickets ahead of time to get in the gate at uwka.org. Again, that web address to get those tickets, uwka.org. I'm Paul Perkins on the Rural Radio Network.